Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick update, if you are tied into the Google ecosystem and are using Google Photos, and that's just to let you know that over the next coming weeks, Google Photos, according to a recent announcement by Google, is going to be getting an update where they are bringing new AI-powered editing tools like Magic Eraser, Photo Unblur, and Portrait Light to all users for free to Google Photos starting May the 15th this year, 2024. So that's in just over a month's time. Now, previously, um, these features were only available to subscribers, as you may well know. And these features now will be accessible to anyone using Google Photos with no subscription required, as mentioned. So just a quick breakdown, if you would be interested and do find yourself using Google Photos. And the first is Photo Unblur, which, as the name implies, is designed to clear up um, blurry photos. And then the next is Magic Eraser. And obviously this allows you to remove and, and enables you to remove background distractions. And then the third new feature rolling out is Portrait Light. And this allows obviously the adjustment of brightness of the light in your different portraits and photos. So previously these um, required a subscription. And according to Google, starting on May the 15th, they mentioned many of the AI-powered editing tools, as we've mentioned in this video, will be available to anyone using Google Photos with no subscription required. And you'll also be able to access, they mentioned these features on more devices, including Pixel tablets. And at this stage, it's not known if some or all of these features will be rolling out eventually to the desktop platform. At this stage, I think starting May the 15th, it will be more for your iOS and Android devices. Um, but there's no clear mention if in the future, some or all of these will roll out to the desktop. But nonetheless, uh, just keeping you posted if you do find yourself tied into the Google ecosystem. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.